Welcome to how to find the settings on your digital SLR camera with capturing true emotion. My name is Val Westover. Let's find the settings on the Nikon D3S. Here are the settings you need to know in order to have more control of your camera and your photography. Camera modes, ISO, aperture, shutter speed, metering mode, white balance, focus mode, autofocus point selection, drive mode, histogram, exposure compensation, and auto exposure lock. Choose an exposure mode by pushing the mode button, then adjust the main command dial. The exposure mode selection can be seen in the top control panel. To have more control of your exposure, select a more advanced mode such as program, aperture priority, shutter priority, or full manual mode. To change the ISO, Push the ISO button, then adjust the main command dial. Your ISO selection can be seen in the rear control panel. To choose an aperture, push the mode button and select aperture priority or manual mode. Then adjust the sub command dial. Your F number, aperture selection can be seen in the top control panel. To choose a shutter speed, Push the mode button and select shutter priority or manual mode. Then adjust the main command dial. Your shutter speed selection can be seen in the top control panel. To choose a metering method, press the metering selector lock button and rotate the metering selector until the desired mode is displayed. To choose white balance, Push the WB button, then adjust the main command dial. Your white balance selection can be seen in the rear control panel. To select the autofocus area mode, rotate the AF area mode selector to choose the desired autofocus mode. To choose an autofocus point, Rotate the focus selector lock to the unlocked position. This allows the multi-selector to be used to select the focus point. Use the multi-selector to select the focus point in the viewfinder or the monitor. To choose a release mode, push the release mode dial lock release button and turn the release mode dial to the desired setting. To access the histogram, push the play button to access an image, then click the top or the bottom of the multi-selector until the histogram is displayed. In program mode, aperture priority or shutter priority mode, the camera is in charge of achieving a correct exposure. If you intentionally want to over or underexpose your image, you can do so by pushing the exposure compensation button and adjusting the main command dial. Your selection can be seen in the top control panel. To lock the camera settings while in program mode, aperture priority, or shutter priority mode, you can do so by pushing the AEL button and holding the exposure button halfway down. Your camera settings will be locked, they won't change on you, and an AEL indicator will appear in the viewfinder. 